Oh, wow. Well, you know, I wrote it just about um, a year before the um, uh, Harvey Weinstein thing. We were all just so pissed off, you know. The whole country was just angry about what was going on, and, and it felt like no one was doing anything about it. So, yeah, it was just it's simply that. They proved that the issue transcends sexual, you know, um, uh, partisanship, and they're entertaining, and, and they can take us on a journey that people, you know, on the left probably couldn't. So, yeah. Margot's vulnerability in those scenes with Roger where she's being harassed. I'm surprised we got that so beautifully. Um, you know, Nicole has this wonderful quirky quality that is consistent throughout, that communicated character without being too much, which was great. And Charlize just has this fierceness throughout that is just fantastic. So, you know, all those three qualities, I think, were the things that I cared most about, yeah. You know, what I've loved most about uh, people seeing it for the first time now is actually hearing what they thought afterwards. I, I like sort of letting people go in a bit blind and then asking them questions after, so I'm excited about that. Yeah, we're having larger cultural conversations about like power dynamics in the workplace, especially in workplaces that involve media and like um, the opportunities people have to abuse that power. And this is a film that talks to those things. And it's about something that I personally didn't know a great deal about before we started shooting. So. Hopefully it teaches people about it. I think we had a feeling. Um, we all believed in each other in the project very much. And there was a real sense of like focus and care to the story and the people it's, you know, talking about. As a father of two little girls, I think it's important uh, for me. And, you know, I hopefully my kids don't have to go through any of the scenarios that these women had to go through. Uh, I think the time is afoot. The Me Too moment is now. Uh, also, as the son of a really uh, strong-willed mother and an older sister, like the thought of what happened in that world doesn't even isn't a, even a reality to me. So uh, I think it's important to tell the world what happened there. I feel like there's so much information being hidden today that this story needed to get out, and that these women are super courageous. I think when you have a story with real characters, uh, a story that's true to life, I think. 
I think everyone knows that and they feel the weight of that. And and I think for me as an actor, anything that can help you like bring some energy to the scene and the, and the weight of the reality of it, I think everyone knows to use all that and that's important. I think with any story, it's like it's like a book. It's like you kind of you can you can read the little tidbits or the back cover, but like once you dive into a book, you it's it has a bigger impact, and that's why movies are important, stories are important, books are important, poetry is important, and I think people will walk away affected by this movie because the story's good and the acting's good and it's fun and it's entertaining and it's of its time. Ah, oh, it was great. It was great. Jay Roach is. The greatest, I got to work with people I love and people I admire all at the same time, so I was very lucky.